it's good to be back. In fact, I wanted to dedicate this segment to something extremely important in sales, which is all about business value. In fact, there is a saying, no value, no sale. No business value for the customer, no sale for you. So what you have to think about is how do I get the customer to calculate business value in their own business terms, in the language of money, KPI, and monetization. That's what is important. So when you think about business value, I wanted to dedicate this segment for you to understand the three horizons for business value creation. The first aspect of business value creation you need to do with your existing customers is what I call lifetime value, sometimes called LTV. So for the investments that your customers have made with you across multiple years, what is their acknowledgement of the value they have received through these investments? It's important for us to know this so that you, between you and your customer, you have a thumb row. Every dollar I invest in you, I get $10 back or $20 back. So whatever is the thumb rule needs to be established. If you're in sales, the second horizon for value creation is primarily on your pipeline. Think about what is the pipeline that you have now and how does that pipeline show up in the business results for your customer? So if you have a million dollars in the pipeline, does that lead to 10 or $20 million of value for your customer? The third horizon is potential. So when you go ahead and think about the potential that your organization has with your customer, what is the full business value you can drive for your customer? Is that a 50 million, it's 100 million? Think about what's the true potential if the entire goodness and richness of your organization was brought to bear on your customer. So the next time you think about engaging with your customers, remember business value is paramount. Remember that value needs to be calculated by your customer and you need to have that calculation across three horizons, lifetime value, pipeline value, and potential value. When you make these three lenses unique to your customer and in your conversations, it will guarantee you success. Your customer will know how much you're able to contribute to them and then value the relationship even further. Good luck as you leverage value to expand on your customer relationships.